Hello, you're welcome. How to solve this nice exponential equation? Solution from here. And what we have here, we can write this as x squared over 25. Can write that as 5 times 5. That's also 5 square. Then equals to here. Also, we have 5 square over x squared. The next step here, we cross multiply x squared times x squared. Then equals to, also here we have 5 squared times 5 squared. Then here also follows on we have same thing multiplying a times a. Can write that as a squared. But this here we can write this as x squared or squared. Equals to, here also we have 5 squared or squared. But this here we take the Right hand side, the left hand side, and we have x square or square minus y square or square, and then equals to zero here. Then this follows when we have a square minus b square, which is the same thing as a plus b into bracket, open bracket, a minus b. Then here is standing as x square. And B standing as 5 squared. That is, yeah, what we have becomes x squared plus 5 squared into brackets. The open bracket x squared minus 5 squared plus brackets. Then equals to 0 here. Which implies, yeah, we have two possible cases. The first one, x squared plus. 5 squared equals to 0, or we have x squared minus 5 squared equals to 0 here. Solving on this side, this follows when we have a squared plus b squared, which is it in as a plus br into brackets, then also open brackets a minus br. Now this what we have here follow this and becomes x plus 5i into bracket then open bracket x minus 5i plus bracket equals to 0 here then here also we have two possible cases the first one x plus 5i equals to 0 or we have x minus 5i equals to 0 here then solving here we have x equals to minus 5i, which is a complex solution here. And here we have x equals to 5i, which is also a complex solution here. We have two complex solutions from here. Then solving on the second case here, which is x squared minus 5 squared equals to 0. This also follows from what we have a squared minus b squared, which is the same thing as a plus b into bracket, open bracket a minus b. As this, what we have here becomes x plus 5 into bracket, open bracket x minus 5 equals to. 0 here. Also, we have two possible cases. The first one, x plus 5 equals to 0. Or we have x minus 5 equals to 0 here. And solving on this side, we have x equals to minus 5, which is a real solution here. And here also we have x equals to 5, which is also a real solution. We also have two real solutions here. Making four solutions together, two real and two complex solutions. Now let's write it out here. Like this we have the four solution in this given problem. You can say the first one x one is equals to five. 
and x2 equals to minus 5. Two resolutions, and we have x3 equals to 5i, then x4 equals to minus 5i, making four solutions, two re and two complex solutions. Now, let's check here. If this satisfies this given problem, that is only x equals to 5, the equation becomes 5 square over 25. This is equals to, also here we have 25 over 5 square. And 5 square, that's 5 times 5, also 25 over 25. Is it equals to, here also we have 25. Over 5 squared, that's 25. Then we can write 25 over 25 as 1, which is equals to also 1 here. Left hand side equals to the right hand side. Hence, we have x equals to 5. Satisfy this given problem. Then, we substitute x equals to minus 5. As well, then. This equation becomes minus 5 all square over 25. Is it equals to 25 over minus 5 all square? Then minus 5 all square. This minus square becomes plus. And 5 square, that's 25 over 25. Is it equals to? Also, here we have 25 over minus 5 squared, that's 25. Then 25 over 25, that's 1. Is it equals to, of course, which is equals to, also 25 over 25, that's 1. Left hand side equals to the right hand side. Then, minus 5 also satisfies this given problem. And also, we substitute x equals to 5i. Then, this equation becomes 5i all square over 25. Is it equals to 25 over 5i all square? Then, 5i all square. This square affects 5. That's 5 squared, then times affect i, i squared over 25. This is equals to 25 over also 5 squared times i squared. And 5 squared, that's 25, then times i squared, the same thing as minus 1. So we have this minus 1 over 25. This is it equals to, here also we have 25 over. 5 squared 25 times i squared minus 1. Then here, yeah, 25 cancelled each other. We have minus 1. Is it equals to also here, yeah, 25 cancel each other? We are left with 1 over minus 1. Then here yeah, we have minus 1, which is equals to 1 over minus 1, also minus 1. Left hand side equals to the right hand side. Then also, 5i to satisfy this given problem. Then also we substitute x equals to minus 5i. That is, this equation becomes minus 5i all squared over 25. Is it equals to 25 over minus 5? i or square then minus square is plus on 5 square that's 25 times i square minus 1 over 25 is it equals to here also we have 25 over also we have 25 times minus 1 that is 25 cancel each other we have minus 1 is it equals to also 25 cancel each other we have 1 over minus 1 and here is minus 1, which is equal to 1 over minus 1 also minus 1. We have left hand side equals to the right hand side. And therefore, minus 5i also satisfies this given problem.
and thank you for watching don't forget this tip subscribe for more videos turn the notification bell share this video with a thumbs up with your comment see you next class and bye for now